by Madison Square Park in Manhattan, and you just might do a double take. There is a new exhibit there that's a real head turner. It's called Briar Patch. Artist Hugh Hayden uses wooden school desks and tree branches to make a bold statement about education. His inspiration tonight, in his own words. A lot of my work has to deal with access to the American dream and this idea of camouflaging oneself into that or assimilation. It's really this idea of this of education as this like potential protected space, but also this place that's hard to uh, inhabit, whether student loans, you know, access education, it takes on a whole significance on COVID in terms of, you know, classrooms are currently not accessible for many people. And even in New York City, it takes on a different significance with all the sort of admissions uh, sort of to get into different schools. And just, a, you know, a variety of barriers to enter that space that once you're in it is a space to thrive. It's sort of, a, in a way, a reflection of, um, you know, the education system at different levels. Some people see it as like growth and, and like, you know, a small tree, you know, becoming this new thing and this idea of new crop, a new generation. So it, for me as an artist, it's it's important that I don't have one prescriptive way of looking at it and that it's, you know, look, it's open to the many means of interpretation. People are welcome to come have their lunch break, um, have an outdoor class, um, and use the desk. It's sort of, they're six feet apart on a grid, so they're socially distant. It's, it's a way of uh, sort of offering an outdoor classroom um, at a time where it's sort of difficult to be inside. It's not only visually powerful and visually exceptional, but it also carries a deeply thoughtful investigation of the situation of American education. For me as an artist, by using these sort of, you know, mundane materials like the tree or school desk as a form, um, there's some hope that if I can change how you think about something as, you know, the big and benign as a tree, you know, it's a way in of, you know, changing how you think about some of the deeper issues that this piece is sort of uh, speaking about. Thanks to producer Katie Keller for putting that piece together for us.